Hey, what's up guys? PippyD here. This is episode 32 of Road to Manchester City. And last episode we did a new method, which is the informed trading method. And right now I'm going to show you guys how to do it before I show you guys some of the deals I picked up. So basically, since I have around 150k, I'm willing to only spend, well I have 190 now, but I'm only willing to spend 40k max on each inform and 12k minimum. So we're going to go to the database. There is a link in the description to that. And you want to put in all informs. 12k minimum price and 40k maximum price since I am on Xbox I will put the price on Xbox but you could switch it to PS3 if you are on PS3 or PC so I click search and this is what comes up and I'm just gonna choose a player here and I think Soldado would be the best option for this uh, I just had him a while ago uh, where's Soldado? you know I'll just do Samwell uh, he's probably right there but I can't see him so I'm gonna go search Samwell's criteria check as cheap as buy now and then we're gonna go and try to bid for one. So Samuel, he goes for around 30k, maybe somewhere around there. I would hope. Okay, so his cheapest is 32k, and then we're gonna go over to Footwiz, and let's say I sell him for 31k. It's gonna tell me that I get 29k. So what I want to do is bid 27k, 2k less than what I'd get, because 2k profit on an inform is good enough. And if we're lucky, we might be able to pick one up for less. I don't expect her to be um, Samuel for 27k bid because it is pretty late. But if you try with other informs, you're bound to find at least a couple. And at night, you will win most of them because not many people are up. So yeah, we didn't find any informs. But that's basically how to do it, guys. And now I'm going to go show you guys the deals I picked up. Okay, so I picked up a guy tying in a 4-1-2-1-2 for 16k. And he should sell for 18, maybe more. I picked up his Howie Des in a 5212 center back for 21k, and this Inler in a 352. This is the second Inler, so don't get mistaken, for 21k. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I also managed to buy a 352 card using the Footwist thing. I don't know if you guys know how to do this, but you go to Ultimate Team, and you go to Formations, and you click View, and it tells you what the cheapest bin price on a formation card is, which is really helpful. So I only paid around 1.5 for the 352 card. And we're going to store that in club, and we're going to put it on Santa Cruz later. So yeah, I'm going to go sell this, these informs that I picked up, and we're going to do another trading session to make more money. And I will see you guys then. Okay, guys, we are back, and we are at 199k. We're literally 40 coins away from the 200k mark, which is a little bit annoying. But other than that, we did sell the Gaetan for 18k, so we made around 1k profit on him. Inler sold for 26, so we made around 3k on him. And Howie did sold for 27, so we made tw uh, about 3k on him. So we made around 7k um, in that trading session with the informs. And now I'm going to go get some more informs and see if we can make some more. Okay guys, I am back and I picked up three players once again. It was kind of a tough day today, but I managed to pick up some nice deals. I picked up this Ramis in a 4-2-3-1 for 14.5. This Jao Moutinho at center mid for 23k. And Huntelar in a 4-1-2-1-2 for 24k. Now I'm going to go sell these players and I will be back when they have sold. Okay guys, we are back and everything has sold and we are at 208k. So the Huntelar sold for 28k. Jao Moutinho sold for 28, Rami sold for 17k, and yesterday some guy was listing up a bunch of players, uh, I mean a bunch of Royces, there was like 4 or 5 of them, for 150 start, and I managed to pick this one up in a 5212 for around 7.7, .7, and I sold him for 9k overnight, so that was a nice little 1k profit on that Royce. So yeah, like I said, we're at a 208k, and quickly I'm going to go put the 352 card we bought earlier and put it on Santa Cruz so he gets 9 chemistry. Uh, let me just find it, there it is. So he's not the quickest striker, but we will replace him in the future with Aguero once we get him. But yeah, that's the team so far, and that's the money we have so far. So we're doing pretty good in the series. We're around 15k this episode. I think next episode we're going to do both methods and hope for the best. So yeah, this has been episode 32 of Road to Manchester City, guys. If you enjoyed, click like. If you didn't, dislike and tell me why in the comments. If you want to see more, be sure to follow me on Twitter. Link in the description. And be sure to subscribe to the channel and you'll be updated on when there's videos. So I'll see you guys then. My name is PPD guys and I'm out.